This is Apollo.io, our all-in-one sales platform to find and close your next deal. And this is Lucia, named after the nickname of the daughter of the founder. Also, an AI sales platform to find and close your next customer. But does it make any difference if you use Apollo or Lucia? And are you really able to find and close customers on this platform? This is what you will find out in this deep dive demo. And in case you're just here for a quick decision, check out my quick review of Lucia, link in the description. So what we will do in this video is we will go on each feature of Lucia, see how usable it is, see how it compares to other platforms like leads.cm with unlimited expert for 20 bucks, Apollo.io, the main character in this scene, or other prospecting tools like Seamless. So when you type in Lucia.com, you find out their main goal is that they find contacts and then close them inside in their tool. So after you create an account for free, you can click on my account here. And then you have a very nice overview of search, engage, enrich, and analytic. This looks so far very similar to Apollo, but in Apollo it's a little bit more split up. So you have your prospect, here engage, here win deals, and here automations, analytics, etc. So what you will find out very quick is that Lucia tries to be the same platform than Apollo, but tries to make everything a little bit simpler. So the main feature of Lucia is of course searching for contact. So what you find are a lot of filters here. You have the company name, that means you can search for a specific company, and then for people working in this company. You can look for the company location, and also here for the contact location. In general, Lucia separates company and contact search functions very strong, while with Apollo, everything seems like it's one thing. That especially starts to matter when you look for specific people, but then things like intent data are only available for looking for companies. So the next filter option is industries. What I like here very much is that you have an overview of all industries, so you can just scroll through them, open the toggles, and just select your industries very easy. Also, you can look for employee headcount, revenue, funding, technologies the companies of these contacts use. So that's basically the tech stack. So when you're looking for companies that sell a service, they might use booking tools. When target audience is e-com, they use maybe Shopify or similar e-commerce tools. So you can filter contacts based on the technologies they use. You have the same with Apollo here. So you can just click on technologies, but with the small difference that you can use this filter option in the people area. Where with Lucia, you really have to click on company to start to use this filter option. And also you can look for specific contact details, what you want to have, contact location, job title, contact name, department, the management level of the contact, and recent job changes. So this so far is just a basic prospecting tool. So let's figure out very quick how it works in practice. For example, when I look for CEO, apply it, and want to have them in the United States, then you can see I have 590,000 contacts. For example, when I apply the exact same filters with Apollo, I have 560,000 contacts. So far, it seems like I have the exact same contacts, the same amount, the same functions, etc. What's of course always interesting is the pricing. Because it's not free to export these contacts, you pay for export credits. So when I click on upgrade here and click on monthly pricing, you see I have credits here, where one credit is one email export and 10 credits is one phone export. That's of course very expensive and you have to be very sure that you like the contact quality. To just put this in perspective, leads.cm, a tool only focusing on finding contact data, is charging 20 bucks per month for unlimited phone number and email exports. So when we log in here very quick, go to LinkedIn leads, also US, and also look for CEO, you will find out that we have 200,000 contacts, so around one third of the amount of Lucia and Apollo, but you can just click on export and a mass export or automated mass export and export all contacts immediately. So for the same amount of exports, I pay with leads.cm 20 bucks per month, while Lucia is of course way more expensive. Actually, there's not really a way to get even so many contacts without talking to their sales team. The reason for that, in my opinion, is of course, first of all, that you have a live search function. So when you click on show the details here, everything is as live as it can be. And you have a lot of more options than with leads.cm, for example, creating lists and creating sequences. So while leads.cm is really only focusing on gathering the contact data without storing anything or creating outbound inside of the platform, Lucia, of course, is more on one sales platform where you can look on the one hand for contacts and of course also for companies. Also, you have a lot of more options on researching specific companies. While with leads.cm, I also have a lot of filter options here, but there's not really this company area where I can look up specific companies. The only function is to actually export the contacts and that's it. So here, a lot of plus points for Lucia or Apollo since they have a lot of more use cases than just getting the data. Also, as you can see, they have slightly more data points. So after you search for your contacts, you can create sequences. That basically means you can create an outbound campaign where you can send emails to these contacts. So you just hit new sequence here can either use one of the templates here or create from scratch. And here, very basic, you can create a subject line, write a body copy, and hit save. So what I like about Apollo here more is that you have an AI function that helps you to actually create the copy. And also with Apollo, you have way more options on combining email outreach with cold calling, LinkedIn outreach, etc. So in case you're more interested in multi-channel outreach, I would definitely recommend using Apollo instead of Lucia. But when you want to have it really simple and just focus on email outreach, I think Lucia is the better solution so far. I will link you down in the description a full Apollo review and demo video where you can see how I created such a sequence, used an AI for that, and also showed you some tricks on how to set everything up. So similar to them with Apollo, you can now click on add email here. Then you basically write a second email in the same thread. So you only have to type in your body copy here, save it again. And now after three days or a custom period of days, you have your second email. So you definitely have to be aware that there are other tools like instantly.ai 
they're way more focused on doing cold email mass outbound, while Lucia is more like an enhanced version on doing manual outreach. For example, Instantly is way better at rotating your email senders and has a lot of more other benefits to send really a high volume of emails. So of course you can add more emails here. And then the next step, you can add contact. So here you have three options, either to use a list you have already created, just click here. And for example, there's your all contacts list or all contacts you have previously saved, you can add them. And then this sequence will be activated. Also, you can just import contacts. So for example, when you use leads.cm, then verify your contacts and then want to use them further, you can just simply import them here or you just prospect in Lucia and have basically the same filter options here and import these contacts. After you import your contacts, you can schedule your campaign. So based on the time when your target audience is online, you can select your times here and send the emails. Also, you have to be aware you have a daily sending limit. So on the one side is a technical limit. So what your Google account allows you to send, this should be around 500 to 1000 emails per day per account. And of course, you have to be aware on what is about your sender reputation. So when you send thousands of emails with new email accounts or not warmed up email accounts, then your emails will get flagged and land in spam. So here you don't really see an option to warm up your email accounts, but you also don't have this with Apollo. So you either have to use a warm up solution like Lambwarm or tools like Instantly or Smartly have unlimited warmups included. Of course, this depends just on your use case. So when you just use your single business email and send a few emails, then this is perfectly fine. So, so far, I would say Apollo has way more options to make multi-channel outreach, while Lucia is only focusing on emailing, what seems for me a little bit strange since it doesn't even have a warm-up solution. But I think they don't really want you to make cold email mass outbound. They want you rather to just look for specific contacts and then create a sequence for this contact or contact profile. Also, Lucia has a Chrome extension. So when you're on a website like Adobe, you see a company overview here. That's very nice for researching. And you also have an employee list and can just click on the contact and then on show details. Then you can either show the email contact, the phone number contact, or the complete details. I have to say here that I like the Chrome extension of seamless.ai way more. Since as you can see my seamless.ai demo, you basically are able to see the full contact profile with one single credit. But Seamless has no outreach functions, so it's only a prospecting tool. While keeping this in mind, I still think that Lucia has a very nice Chrome extension. You have a very clean overview of the company, the contacts, and it's very nice when you are SDR, want to outreach to the employees, want to do your research, and then want to save contacts to a list, create a sequence, etc. So the next feature of Lucia is enriching. I have to be very honest, when I did my long review of Apollo and of Seamless, I did an experiment and used contact data of leads.cm and then imported the data in these tools to enrich them, I really had the feeling that enriching is very expensive. With Seamless so far, I liked that I got a little bit more information like private phone number and private email, but with Apollo, I saw zero results at all. So since I already saw with the search function of Lucia that I don't get private numbers or private emails at all, I don't really expect to find more data than with leads.cm. And when you want to use enrichment for verifying data, you're way cheaper when you just use a verification service. But how I expect to use the enrichment tool in a good way is for example, when you use the API, then when you get fresh leads, for example, from paid ads, you might be able to use the contact data of only the email you got from a contact, and then get a lot of more contact information. But of course, you can also just try using leads.cm data, importing it here, and see if it helps you out to get a higher quality. But if I had to recommend the perfect enrichment tool, I would really say that Seamless is the best tool so far, since in general, it has way more contact information than all other tools. The last feature is the analytics tool. Here, you basically just see your usage on the one hand of you, and of course, of your sales team. And that's basically it. So Lucia so far seems for me a little bit like a washed out version of Apollo. It seems like to have the same contact data, but it's not very competitive against leads.cm or the amount of contacts of seamless.ai. And the only reason to use it would be when you like the user interface more and are only focusing on engaging specifically with emails in a low volume. Also important to consider is the pricing. So with Lucia and Apollo, you have each credits for emails and for phone numbers, what makes it generally very expensive and very hard to use sometimes for multi-channel outreach and you reach limits very quick. In general, the prices are very intransparent, but when I try to calculate which tool is more expensive, Lucia or Apollo, Lucia was slightly more expensive, phone numbers around double the price, and emails were around 1.2x the price. But of course, it's hard to calculate. Since to really scale up, you have to contact the sales team, and they might just tell you what you need to hear to get closed. A general big minus for Lucia is that you are not able to get an unlimited amount of credits, while with Apollo, you can just level up your credits with two clicks. This is just one hurdle more for Lucia, but it's not a big deal breaker when you are just a beginner or use the tool in a lower scale. In general, it's a little bit crazy for me. It's really how low the credits are. So you pay so fast, so much money. What is nothing against Lisa.cm? So to recap this very quick, is Lucia a tool to find and close your next deal? I would say yes, but it's not such a full package than Apollo. It has less contact data than Seamless and it's way more expensive than leads.cm. Also, there's no warm up, even if it's focusing on just cold email outbound. And there are a lot of more things that just don't add up. Even the randomness of the name, their logo and the whole customer experience. But to be honest, the user interface is very clean. It feels simple to use and there are not really big flaws against it. It's just that other tools do, in my opinion, a better job at the exact same things. But if you have a different opinion, feel free to comment this down below. Also, when you have some questions around Lucia, just comment it below. I will answer all your questions. Check out similar demo videos for leads.cm, Apollo, seamless.ai. Links down in the description. 
give the video a thumbs up when it helped you to make an informed decision. Feel free to subscribe for more SaaS reviews and I see you in the next one.